wedding in a loft on Emma Walker Worthington. And I was married in the Richburg Barbershop, and Emma was my maid of honor in 1943. Yes, so it's still good memories. And I think that's just the way it has been. Perhaps this afternoon is going to seem rather short to you because you're all having such a great time. But I hope all of you can get to see all of you because I feel that this reunion is going to be one of the highlights for this year, 2001. So again, a very warm welcome to all of you and have a wonderful afternoon. I showed it the first day a while ago. What a different place. I don't really mind. And of course, Russ is down too. No, we got into school early but, in the morning. But Limburger in those big heating <laughs> ventilator. You went there. We went up and down the halls and spread Limburger on the street. And the skunk, yeah. And the skunk, too. Yeah. No. Stuff like that. Huh? You don't want to show that to your kids, that's for sure. Uh, yeah, actually, you know, if we, if we told all this, somebody, somebody told somebody about all this before it happened. Yeah, but they did. But they. Did. But they would, uh, and, then, and then they keep him busy, and so he'd talk about all his war experiences, and they thought that was great. We didn't have to study. So in the class of the exam, wasn't it? No, all the time. Sure, all, all the time. All the time. So, Dawn, we don't have to get a little change. Yeah, we always change. All I learned was typing. I didn't learn sure anything. <laughs> Thanks, dear God, for imbuing this nation with that strong, supportive spirit that makes us appreciate the land of the free. And we want to thank you also, God, for the impact people who helped to shape our lives. Although it was a great challenge, dear God, with your help, our principals and teachers won the battle of wisdom over youth so that our lives will be a living demonstration of your great commandment to love our neighbors as ourselves. May we do that until our universal love encircles the globe and we will find that we no longer have any enemies. In peace and love, we thank you in advance for answered prayer. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, God.
I, yeah, I, was, I walked by here. Was it on? No, you you didn't actually talk. Uh, talk? I got nothing to say. Come on, Peter. Hi, uh, Peter Solis. Uh, I graduated uh, in 1952 from the Chancellor Street. Chancellor Street. <laughs> Thank you. They're all living in Amarillo, Texas. Right, I'm Edward Long. I graduated from, uh, in 1949 at Council Rock when they, when they consolidated uh, and went to Richburg until 1946. I'm now living in Levittown, Pennsylvania. And I'll turn it on and you can say whatever you want. Say your name. Right. I'm Bill Walker. I graduated in the class of 44, and I live uh, on Lake Norman, North Carolina. Our commission here has promised to organize all of the alumni so that we can save the school. So um, he signed a pledge today, and I hope that he just lived. A little bit, okay, I'll line this up here so I get your face. Hi, I'm Ed Hubbard. I graduated in 1943, Richburg High. I now reside in Montana. I like it out there, Bitterroot Valley, and uh, I'm glad to see a lot of old friends. All right? Thank yeah. Oh. You can say whatever you want. <laughs> well, I'm Nat Jean Love, and um, I've been in this community all my life and went to the same school all together, and I was mostly interested in sports and um, uh, well, I, I don't know what else I could tell you. I don't think I was a very popular kid in, in the school, but uh, here I am. I'm still here. <laughs> Okie doke. It's been a wonderful, it's been a good day out there, and uh, we're, I think we're going to have a good time. <laughs> Ma'am? Yes. Ma'am? Yes. I'm yes. very glad to be here to see all my own. Oh, okay. I'm Raymond Gill. Okay. At the old Brownstone Schoolhouse. Yeah. It was built the same year I was born. You can say your name and and, and what year did you? Yeah, well, I'm certainly happy to be here, and uh, it's a. I'm proud to be a member of the reunion of Richboro High School. Thank you. I'm. Delighted to be here. I'm from the class of 48, and I think it's wonderful that they're having that to get everyone together. Thank you. Okay, say say whatever you want. It wasn't a picture; it's a movie. You can say, you can talk if you want. Happy uh, anniversary to all of us that's been in school together all these years. I'm one of few words, and so we'll just let it go with that. <laughs> And when did, when did you attend the school? Uh, 1937, 1946. Okay. You want, you want to say, it's not a picture, it's a movie, so you can say whatever you want. <laughs> I'm Ruth Wright. I was an Osmond from Richboro, and I went to Richboro School like everyone else here. It's good to be here today. Nice to see old friends. But you're glad to be here. When, when did, did you both go to Richboro School? No. Oh. Just, I went to Richboro School. Okay. And I was here when I was all day. Second class to graduate from Council Rock, but we got in on the work of the committee and been working on it ever since. <laughs> my name's Beth Ann Gilbert, and my father was Mr. Raymond Gilbert. I sure wish he was still around that he could come to this. My mother is Mary Ann Gilbert. She was a teacher at uh, Rich Burr School. And she's 95, she's doing pretty well, but she just didn't feel up to coming today, so I'm sending her greetings. Ready? Well, I'm Ed Reif, and I live in Kings Park now, and I used to live in Richburg, but I never went to the Richburg School. Uh, my folks moved into the White House and the Old Stone School and moved back, and we moved in in 1944. I did. And you didn't? Okay, and anything you'd like to say about today or about? Oh, it's good to be here and see old friends. 
Your name? Charles Sturzel. Jean Sturzel. Okay. Just, All right. Thank you. Just for documentation. <laughs> okay. My name is Don Wright. Uh, I'm a Richmond Elementary School graduate. Hi. I'm here with Don. Thank okay. You. Thank you. Hi. Uh, I got my. You what? can, oh, this is what? <laughs> you can just say your names and when you went to school, the maybe. First reason I went to Richmond. I was uh, next to the last class there. Okay. Dan Circle Holland, the PA, went to uh, Richboro School from uh, first grade all the way up to uh, eighth grade. Oh, I don't know what you want me to say. I. <laughs> and you. And when did you graduate from Richboro School? 1925. Your name and maybe when you went to school. Sure. My name is Dottie Maxwell Beasley. I grew up on Bonnie Road. And I'm probably one of the babies of the group. Uh, I graduated from Council Rock in 1965. But uh, started kindergarten at Richboro Elementary School in, let's say, 1952, probably. And uh, had a wonderful experience. Thank you. My name is John Edwards. We'll just be on the internet. That's a 39. Okay, anything else? Where do you live? I live in well, Florida mostly, but I live up in Lehigh oh, yeah. in, in the summertime. So you, you came up quite a distance. Well, yes. Even this morning I come quite a distance. Right. Uh huh. And where did you live when you went to school here? Well, I lived out on, uh, well, I just went through there and it's all new homes in there now. I didn't even recognize it. It was first Ivy Day and Art Day where I lived. Right. It's uh, off, off of Hapler Road and uh, off of Bristol Road and in that section well, there. Okay. Yeah, we were all farmers. We knew everybody in the town because we were all farmers. There wasn't that many. There was only 13 of us in the class. Well, and really, that's right. I, we had we played baseball up on the I guess we had a diamond at Twenningford Road up there. We played plus at the school. Now they moved the old school back and tore the other one down, so that don't look like it used to either. Right, right. We don't even know where we are anymore. <laughs> yeah, good old rich people. Well, actually, my family's been here since 1794. Our old farmhouse was on Tan Yard Road. Oh my. My great 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 granddad moved there in 1794. He come from North Carolina. Well, 39. Rich for high school baseball team. <laughs> okay, I'm Jim Cruz. I went to the Richborough School, I believe, in 1949 and 1950, and eventually graduated from the Chancellor Street School. Uh, the last graduating class from the old Chancellor Street School in Newtown. Okay. Carl Huffman, Dr. Carl Huffman, UT 36 High School. Say your name and. I'm Lois Craven Ferguson. I went to Richborough School from 1948 to 19. And when did you go to Richboro School? Well, it was the next to the last class I went through. Okay. Well, I'm Libby Rook, and I came to Richboro when I was in 10th grade, transferred from Langhorne, which annoyed me very much at the time. You can just Cynthia Valley and Schick. Uh, I went to elementary from fourth grade through sixth, and then through the junior high. So from the time we were four and five till we graduated eighth grade, I, I'd have to think about. Okay. Clara Lee Dudgeon. I am did not graduate from Richburg because I live in Southampton. My husband was a graduate here, uh -huh. and. Uh, he taught in the school too. He taught at Richboro School. Yes. Oh, how about that? What did he, what did he teach? Was it just general classes or? Yes. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure what he taught. <laughs> I, did he teach there when uh, um, Cammy Wilson's wife was a music teacher? Do you know or? I really don't know. Mm -hmm. Many years ago. Many years. <laughs>
You can just say your name and my when. Name? Emily Weir. And when did you go to school at Richboro? Uh, uh, I'm Carol Weir. Carol Weir. With me. My father's nephew, uh, I guess you'd say. Carol. Uh, Carol's father and my father were brothers. Okay. Just say your name. I'm taking my picture right. <laughs> I'm Dorothy Finney Wright. My name's Wright. It was Dorothy Finney. <laughs> and you went to Richboro School? Yes. Uh -huh. And what year was that? I uh, graduated in 1941. And where did you live? I lived in Holland all my life. You still live in the same house that you lived in then? I just built a house on top of the hill. So my father owned the property. Okay. He was a businessman in Holland that owned the uh, post office and the school store in Holland and, the, and the also the mill race he owned. Well. Marion Doan Kane, and I graduated from council. Uh, my name is Edward Law. I lived in Ivy Land on the uh, Tanner Road, and I graduated uh, for Council Rock in 1949. I went to Richburg up until uh, 1947, and I consolidated the school with Newtown in 47 and made it Council Rock. So my last year in Richburg was 1947. Okay. And what did your family do in the area? We were farmers. Farmers? Yeah. And where was the farm? It was on Hatbar Road. Okay. If you know where the Tanner store is? Yes. We were eight tenths of a mile up on the right. I'm Bill Allen. And I'm, I'm 81 and I'm miserable just for fun. <laughs> and I'm Doris Weir Ladd. And I went to Richburg School from first grade to seventh grade. And you taught at Richburg School? Well, I taught in the Council Rock School District for six years. And I'm Peggy Weir Allen. Went to Richburg School, graduated from Council Rock. <laughs> So the founders are running back by the township and as they're running back, yeah, you don't realize that it goes until you stay here. Down the road, my brother Bob had, had a herd. Do you remember that? Bob had calves? Yes, mm -hmm. You guys better sit down or you're going to be tired. And out that road, I don't think in two minutes. You had to turn it's left on gut. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah. <laughs> Better get out of here. Yeah. 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 Yeah.